hour ago and uh, just in time for this beautiful sunset behind me. Um, tonight our first stop is Buddha Bar in Imeril Vigli, which is a super trendy, I mean there's a few Buddha Bars around the world anyway, but the one in Santorini is lovely so we're going to head there and have a bit of sushi. Um, but we're staying here for about a week. Um, we're staying at Pegasus, this is which is behind me, uh, first. Then we're off to Mystique and then Videma, so we're doing like a little crawl around the island. Uh, so come and join me, it's going to be fun. So Mel and I have just arrived at the Buddha Bar yes. um, and it is absolutely beautiful. They've literally given us this epic table. Honey moon table. Honey moon table. And we've got like a beautiful view of the entire island. It's so gorgeous. I'm with Mel again today um, and we're visiting Ia today so we're going to do like a little photo shoot in and around these beautiful kind of gorgeous village uh, style buildings that go up the side of the cliff. It's really colourful and really pretty. Um, so we're doing a photo shoot and then we've got dinner at um, a gorgeous hotel called Mystique. Um, so yeah, come with us. <laughs> We've just discovered the, um, this gorgeous little spot in Ia, which is actually one of the most famous Instagram spots. So it's kind of around the other side, um, at the other, at the end of Ia, as it were. Um, but look how beautiful it is. So I've quickly got changed into my little pink dress, little pink outfit, so it stands out against the background. But it's so pretty here. Um, gear on the place. Um, it's not your usual bougie kind of Instagram floral place, yeah. but it's all about the food and it's yummy. So this is Giros on Pitta and we've got a little Greek salad um, and it's super cute. Look, it's just this kind of vibe. So tonight we're having a little wander around Ia, which is this beautiful kind of cascading white uh, village going down the side of the cliffs. Um, and it's just filled with beautiful little shops and cafes, which, I, which we came to earlier this morning. But now um, we're post-shoot and we're going to have a little wander around. Look how chic it is. Love shopping here, it's gorgeous. <laughs> so, um, we've had 
had a wonderful day in Ia, and now we've come down right to the bottom by the water. This is basically called a Moody Bay, and it's where all these incredible fish restaurants are um, in the harbour. And if you look behind me, we've got today's catch, um, and then there's a sea literally there. So when you're eating your dinner or your lunch, you can literally dangle your feet in the water, and it is totally beautiful. It's very lovely. I totally recommend coming here. Tonight we're off to a beautiful restaurant at the top of the cliffs called the Athenian House. Um, so I've actually dressed up a little bit like Athena, the goddess of hunting and wisdom and all sorts. So I've got my little Athena crown on and a very beautiful blue dress, which is very Athenian. Um, and it's just, I just wanted to quickly show you the swimming pool because it's so beautiful. And then we're going to just walk over because it's in a mirror of Eagley, so it's only like a 10 minute walk away. So come with. Athenian house and it is absolutely beautiful. We got a little bit lost because there's a lot of kind of meandering streets just behind us so we went all the way down to the bottom of the cliff and then trekked all the way back up but we've now found it and it's totally worth it because it's so beautiful. This is the view from the corner so we're going to get the full sunset but it's just so pretty in here. Check this out. Very traditional and beautiful and bougie. <laughs> Super, super excited today. We've just arrived at Mystique Hotel. Uh, Mystique is in Ia and uh, it's basically one of the best hotels in Santorini for sure, but also one of the best hotels in the world as voted by magazines like Condé Nast Traveller and the Luxury Travel Awards. Um, so yeah, so I am mega, mega happy to be here. I'm going to show you around the hotel a little bit, but it's basically beautiful kind of architecture. I know this soft kind of sandy stone um, and these beautiful kind of organic sculptural shapes that go up the side of the cliff um, and it's yeah it's stunning so um, I'll show you around this is the infinity pool behind me um, I'm gonna show you around as I am in this hotel a lot of the time but our food has just arrived and today we're having lobster oh my god how delicious does that look so beautiful Hey guys, so it is super hot today. Um, we're having a little tour of Fira, which is just behind me here. So Fira is the capital in Santorini. Um, and we had to come into the town because uh, we need to get our PCR test, um, which was super quick because we're flying back to London in a couple of days. So we just went to the clinic in and out. They just gave us a quick COVID test um, and then we'll get our results later today. So that's perfect. And then this afternoon, we're gonna have a little wander around this beautiful place. Hey guys, 
welcome to my beautiful room at Vedema. So we've moved uh, from kind of in town into Meglacori, which is the countryside. So this hotel is all about being in like a countryside, traditional farmhouse, beautiful luxury hotel uh, in Santorini. So this is a suite, so this is the living room. We've got all the goodies in the, uh, in the fridge here. Um, and there's lots of wine because we're in the wine country. Um, this is the lovely bedroom. It's very chic, very understated, very elegant. We've got um, his and then hers wardrobes over here, so there's no fighting over wardrobe space. Big, massive TV. And then you come into this very beautiful and minimal kind of bathroom. So we've got this huge walk-in shower. I'd say there's enough space for about six people in there. <laughs> and then we've got his and hers um, gorgeous kind of mar marble um, sinks. And then a huge tub to soak in and look at the view outside. So pretty. And also in my rush to uh, show you around the room and show you how fabulous it was, I forgot to tell you that actually Vedema is a real favourite in Santorini uh, amongst um, celebrities and royalty. There's a lot of kind of uh, kings, queens, princes from different countries who come to stay here. And quite recently Lady Gaga and her entourage came here too because it's so kind of like far removed from the strip. It's much more kind of private and really exclusive. So it's a perfect place if you're a celeb seeking a bit of solace. just arrived at Vedema. We actually arrived last night, but this morning we're just doing a little photo shoot in and around the grounds of the hotel because it's so beautiful. Um, as you can see, I've got my kind of Athena um, tiara on yet again. <laughs> I'm going a bit obsessed. But what's really lovely about our hotel is that we've actually got a rooftop which looks out over the Blue Dome. So we're going to go over there and do a shoot a bit later on as well. down a moody bay yeah. haven't Hi. we guys Hi. Um, and now we're just waiting um, to go into Sunset Tavern which is the best restaurant yeah, it's beautiful isn't it really amazing seafood um, and we're gonna have this gorgeous view of the sunset yeah. oh, sorry. So it's our last day here in Santorini. I'm pretty devastated to be leaving and going back to London. Um, it is such a beautiful island and everything about it I absolutely adore. I've had an amazing time when we were staying over in Imeravigli in the kind of white cascading uh, beautiful hotels down the side of the cliff. Um, loved shooting in Ia with the gorgeous churches in the background and then had a really lovely relaxing last few days here at Vedema in the wine country down in the south. It's just super elegant understated um beautiful hotel I've, I've, yeah it's the whole trip has been absolutely amazing so i hope you enjoyed my youtube and if you did then please leave a comment below and uh, if you have any questions let me know as well um and uh yeah hit like and subscribe if you haven't already and i shall see you soon over and out <laughs>